You know, Gasprin has always been one of my least favorite sponsors. In Cars 1, I didn't really care for Floyd Mulvey Hills design, but in Cars 3, they, in my opinion at least, really butchered it. But that all changes today, when I will be open, uh, in opening and unboxing the one and only Richie Gunset. So, of course, Richie is the next-gen Gasprin racer. And so, let's be take, uh, let's dive in right to the package. Uh, it's got the classic um, uh, desert blur background. I f did forget to mention Legzanati bumpers. Uh, he has been released in case E and F originally, but there are also some new cases that are coming out that feature him in. Uh, Disney Pixar cars, of course. There he is. Nice art. Here he is inside there with the name tag. And on the side, of course, his series, the Next Gen Piston Caprices. On the back, you've I've got a, a really perfect, um, perfect picture there of like all the Next Generation racers taking over and the Queen looking confused. And it says, "Will the impressive Next Gen racers break Lionel McQueen's winning streak?" Spoiler alert: They do. And on the back here, we can see Chase Racelet, Michael Roeder, Ryan and St. Laney, and Cam Spinner. Check out my review of him right up there. But, uh, yes, obviously this is made in Thailand. But that about does it for the packaging. Now, I've had Richie for a while, and he's just been waiting to be opened. So I guess I'll go ahead and do that right now. Alright, I'm back with Richie opened up, and I must say, I love this car. Even if he's from Thailand, I still like him, and he's one of my new fa He's probably my favorite next-gen so far, at least die-cast-wise, that I have. So taking a look at him, I guess we'll start with the expression. He's got a very determined look there. He's also very shiny due to the fact he's made in Thailand. Uh, on the hood here, we can see the Gasper logo, yellow and purple now. Um, and it's more so, and it's kind of like a pill. I do not have any of the uh, original gas producers. But as I said before, I never read it. He has this really cool shade of blue. That it looks really good off camera. It's kind of hard to tell on camera. But, um, uh, he looks, um, it's definitely, it's very similar to Floyd movie heels from the first movie but so I like that um so yeah determined expression there with his lights and grill yellow bumper with some vents there on the side we can see his next gen light year tires number 70 with the some yellow and purple stripes you can see the pills there uh, more pills there Gasprin with his contingency sponsors of the Piston Gup, Combustor, Carbon Cyber, and Synergy. On the back, more pills with that going across. He does indeed have window bars. Number 70 with the strip going across. On his spoiler here, I really like. It's yellow and it says gas in like purple and print in the bluish color. You can see all the pills there. Here's the back, it just says Gasprin with the tail lights, number 70, and Rookie Stripes, which is one thing I don't like, how they always put Rookie Stripes on the next gens, because it kind of makes them look out of place. So, on the base here, uh, you can see the date stamp, and a bunch of other information, but, yeah, pretty self-explanatory, other than that. So yeah, I guess that about does it for the close-up review. Now I'm going to go ahead and wrap it on up, and I'll see you guys in the Thank you all so much for watching my review here on Richie Gunsit. If you liked it, make sure to subscribe by clicking here, or watch another video by clicking here. That's all for today, folks. JS Cars 8, signing out.